Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams. Next week, we have the Monte Carlo Masters, which is one of the biggest tournaments on the clay court season. It's an ATP 1000 event. And we have some big names that are playing in that event, as we'd expect, some big returns, but we're also missing some big names as well. So let's go have a look at the withdrawal list so far. So these are some of the players that have pulled out over the last couple of weeks through injury. Matteo Berrettini, he's pulled out. Kopfer has also pulled out of this one. Daniel Medvedev has pulled out. We all know that he got the hernia during the Miami Open, so he'll be out for a while. We don't know when he's coming back, but not playing in Monte Carlo. And Rafa Nadal, with that rib injury, he's pulled out of Monte Carlo. We don't know when he's coming back, but he could be out for six weeks, which means a majority of the clay court season. It's not too many players at the moment, but it's not about how many players are pulled out, it's about who's pulled out. We've lost three of the biggest players in the world, three top tenors in Berrettini, Medvedev, and Nadal. But for guys like Medvedev and Rafa, especially, we're looking at guys who are playing very well this season, and Medvedev obviously has been number one for a couple weeks this year. He would have been playing against Djokovic for that number one ranking, and Rafa would have maybe played Djokovic for the first time in 2022. We haven't seen them cross paths yet. But let me know down in the comments below, out of those guys, who are you going to miss the most? I know a lot of people are going to miss Rafa, uh, but he might be back sooner than we think. Uh, Medvedev, we don't know when he's coming back. Berrettini, not sure about him either. So we might not see these guys at Monte Carlo. Hopefully we'll see them sooner rather than later. But let me know down in the comments below, who are you going to miss the most out of the ones who have withdrawn so far?